and this is the box it came in. Standard cardboard box. I don't own the original Naked 2, so I don't know how their boxes are, but I know that the Naked 3 boxes are very nice, and they have this embossed logo and very uh, classy box packaging, right? So this one looks eh. So it's a dupe though, right? So let's get on with the comparison. We do have the shades with the same names. Okay. Oh, they're with the same names. Excuse my nails. Okay. Um, let's get on with the swatching. Okay, let's take half baked. And as you can see, it looks like a gold color, but it's more like a bronzy color. And I'm just going to swatch that. And it comes out like a nice bronzed color. But I do own the Half Baked already in the Urban Decay um, Book of Shadows. And right away you see a different in color, a difference in color. And those are two very different shades. Although they're beautiful, they're the same in texture, um, the Half Baked is a gold, while the Half Baked in the Dupe is a bronzy color. Okay. Also, to compare it, we have YDK. So we are going to take YDK from the Naked 2. Nice taupe, right? So we're going to swatch it. Really beautiful, nice, frosty, okay, taupe color. And then we're going to take it out of the Book of Shadows as well. The one in the Book of Shadows is darker than the one in the dupe. But again, the same te uh, texture, the same sheen, okay? But the color is different. The shade is different. Slightly different. Not too much of a difference, but slightly. Okay, the next one that I can compare would be the, let's see the I think suspect is it no not suspect yeah suspect I have the roller girl palette the original and I'm swatching it's a nice taupe as well with a little brown tinge beautiful and now I'm testing suspect in the dupe That's the dupe. I'll put that here a little more. Again, beautiful finish, different pigmentation, or not different pigmentation, but the color is different. It's more like a pinkish tone from the dupe, and it's a topi from the original. So that's the dupe, that's the original. Okay, the next color that we can compare is, let's see, Verve. Okay, this is from the Roller Girl palette. Verve, beautiful white, beautiful. And let's see how this Verve swatches. Right away, I can see the two differences. Um, this verb looks like a, a darker taupe, while my original verb is like a light, light beige color. So let's try the verb on the dupe. Yeah, the verb on the dupe it is darker. Light, but with, you know, a dark tinge compared to the white and brightness of the verb of the original. So, yeah, I think, oh yeah, did I do chopper? No, okay, one more. 
which is chopper. That's the dupe. Put it right here. It's chopper. It's gorgeous. Beautiful. And so let's try the other chopper. Again, the chopper from the ammo palette is much brighter with an orangey tone compared to the chopper from the dupe which is gorgeous as well but it's a totally different shade it's more on the pinkish side so I'm still happy though I only paid nine dollars for both palettes compared to the $53 price mark that I had to pay for my original, you know, the Naked 3. So I'm very happy. Also, it comes with the brush. Very nice and fluffy and soft. And it has the logo on there as well. So overall, I'm pleased with the palette. I'm going to consider it a different palette. Basically, I'm not going to compare it to the original because I don't own it. So I'm just going to look at this palette as a different eyeshadow palette that has different colors in it, variations of, of pinks and browns and just a nice overall palette, neutral palette. And the case is sturdy. Okay. So I'm very pleased. I'm very pleased with my Naked 2 and Naked 3 dupes from tmart.com and very quickly also from tmart I purchased a lip palette and I did try these colors and I did not break that break out in them and gorgeous 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 36 colors and they are very pigmented Let me wipe my hand here so I can show you this pink down here right there look at that beautiful the red gorgeous this mauve color all of them are nicely pigmented I'm going to swatch it right here so you can see BAM so beautiful beautiful colors and I paid 1050 I believe it was for the um, lip palette from T Mark. And it came in this black case with the ingredients, and it has an uh, expiry date of November 2016. There. And I'm very pleased with my purchases on T Mark. So you guys check them out. It's tmart.com. I bought this with my own money, and I'm a happy camper. So God bless you. Have a great day. And thanks again for joining me on the Color Wheel Gallery. Bye.